My name is Justin Ryan. What I do is I create anatomical models based off patient data. This is an aorta. So what we have here is the biggest blood vessel leading off the body. We want to understand how malformations or diseases such as a stenosis, which is a narrowing in an aorta, can lead to high pressure or low pressures in different areas of this anatomy. We take patient data, 3D print it with SolidScape product, and then we are able to do experimentation to allow us to better understand how uh, our anatomical systems actually change the flow patterns, and more so, how we can best treat patients with the same type of anatomy. I've been doing this for about four years now, just into my fifth year, and the incredible amount that 3D printing has changed anatomical modeling has been quite significant, and that's, that's an understatement. Doctors and physicians are used to seeing grayscale images on a screen, very similar to what we have back here. This is a CT scan. So this is what they're used to seeing, something very two-dimensional in terms of representation. But 3D printing can bring that to the physical world. So we can create a realistic cast based off patient data for many purposes, some surgical planning, medical education, or even experimentation. Right now we're in an emergent environment. There's a patient that has some type of malformation in their anatomy, some type of disease of a structure. We can visualize that based off CT images we can reconstruct in the computer and then 3D print it. So a doctor can actually hold a patient's anatomy in their hand before he or she ever operates on a patient. That is not just delivering a promise of 3D printing, but it's changing the entire architecture of what medicine is. Oftentimes I talk to, to patient families or doctors about 3D printing. They feel like it's this technology far into the future, this some Star Trek vision, but it's, it's not the case. We're doing 3D printing now in a hospital for patients. And just knowing that five years from now or even a year from now, that technology is going to change and allow us to do even more processes, that's what personally excites me.